and gentlemen, welcome to your fine, beautiful faces. I hope you're well. Welcome to another new car on GTA 5, the Declassy Tornado. It is classed as a sports classic, and I will be honest with you, I'm not going to go through all the specs and all the technical jargon and all that gibberish. All I want to do is upgrade the car. I want to show you how much it is. I want to show you Benny's page because here it is in all its glory. Right here, 30,000 off the bat. It's freaking, you know what? I actually really like driving this. It was quite a smooth drive down. You know, I, I, I want to say that we all love the T20. We all love the Osiris, but... Every now and again, we just want to drive a normal car. I mean, 130 miles per hour is top speed, and it is rear axle, which is pretty decent, I guess. But um, 30 foul straight off the bat. And I mean, that, that's quite, it's quite decent. Less to go away. Seriously, I, I don't want any, I, I don't even know what you're trying to sell me. Pegs, maybe? I don't know. But if we, if we jump in, Benny, come and upgrade the car. I mean, this is all I want to do, and this is what all you guys want to see, really. Is it fully upgraded? So how much is it to upgrade? 375,000. Damn. That's actually, I will be honest, that's actually quite cheap. I mean, oh, the interior has already changed as well. Damn. That yellow interior on that black actually looks really, really nice. I quite like that. So, obviously, we're going to have the normal armor. We're going to have the normal brakes. I mean, it's going to be pretty standard. Now, what do the front bumpers look like? Damn. Actually, they're quite badass. It, it keeps the look of the car. It doesn't change it too much, which I really, really like. Like, some cars, you can get it, and it's just, boom. The car looks totally different as soon as you stick on a bumper. I quite like this. I quite like the teeth. I quite like the teeth. Have we got the teeth on the back? Oh, we can stick a wheel on the back. Oh, I'm not a big fan of the wheels on the back. Ugh. Is, that's literally it. We have to stick a wheel on the back, pretty much. Oh, I'm, I'm not a big fan of the wheels, but... You know what, let's, let's just get the Tornado one, I guess, for the sake of it. Now, Chassis. Hmm. What is it? Oh, we've got this one. Look. Oh, actually, that, that's quite cool. A nice little bit of trim right there. That's pretty decent. I quite like that. A nice little bit of trim. You know what? We're actually going to have the trim. Why not? Good old aerials. Everybody loves an aerial. I mean, you've got to listen to the radio. I mean, they're quite decent, actually. The spring. What about the trip? Oh. Interesting, interesting. I'm going to keep the box standard because, well, we don't know what it's going to look like just yet, do we? Let's be honest. And we'll have a chrome oh, tank. I mean, we've got to chrome everything, let's be honest. Now, what can we do to the engine? Now, I'm super excited to see what we can do to the engine. Oh, my God. So, literally, the air filter by the looks of things doesn't change, but the actual engine blocks do. I mean, that one, to me, looks the best. I mean, we could get it chromed, but I don't like chroming the engine. Chroming the engine seems a waste, in my opinion. Like, you've got to keep the engine color the exact same color as the car. But th that's just my take on it. You you guys could be totally different. Oh, so this is where we change the air filter. All right, okay. My bad, my bad, my bad. Actually, I quite like it. I quite like the stock. I, I genuinely quite like the stock. Hmm. I actually am going to keep it stock like that. Hmm, it looks pretty decent. Alright, exhaust. What can we do with the exhausts? Alright, so we've got some twins on the rear. We've got some twin shotguns on the rear. Oh. We've got some sides. Huh. I quite like those shotgun sides. Those shotgun sides look amazing. Oh my god. Let's go with the shotgun sides. Fenders. Oh. Oh. Fender ornaments. Damn, son. Look at those. A nice little bit of trim. Everybody loves a little bit of trim. Oh, my God. What? Oh, damn. See, look, I don't want the engine popping out just like this. I, I do like... Although... Oh, uh, no. I think if we're going to upgrade a 1950s car, we need to keep it looking 1950s. We really do. We really do. So let's go with a classic. Hydraulics, yes. Obviously, we need the most expensive, without a doubt. Interior. I mean, the interior is going to be pretty much exactly the same as any other. Is it not? I mean, all the lowriders are pretty much the same. Like, nothing... There's nothing spectacular. There's nothing different about the insides of them at all. You can obviously change the color. I do like the black on yellow, though. The black on yellow is actually really, really nice. It works really well with the car. 
Ornaments, obviously it's the same ornaments as always. Nothing's gonna change. I mean, why would it? <laughs> There's no reason for it to change, is there? Let's be honest. Oh! The action dude. I'm gonna keep it standard, actually. I like the wood veneer. The wood veneer is actually quite nice. I think, I'll be honest, I'll keep the entire inside of it just legit bog standard. I don't think I want to change anything inside. Silver? Oh, maybe change this actually to um, ice white. I do like the ice white. I mean, what, uh, I was going to say, can we do anything with the lights? But obviously, it's all the Xeons. Now, livery. This is what we want. So, we want to see what the wraps are. Oh, my God. Holy shit. The car actually looks like it's on fire with that yellow. Oh, my. There's a... Yeah, the, the angel is there. She's actually on the bonnet. Oh, my God. She's on the uh, bo uh, boot as well. Oh, my God. I wasn't expecting that. The girls. Oh, hello. <laughs> I was like, where's the girls? There is no girls. They're there. They're on the side of the car. Huh. Okay. Uh, I'm not too sure how I feel about these, actually. There doesn't really seem to be anything... Special, I guess anything that's truly standing out. I mean it does all seem to be very 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 norm like that literally doesn't seem to be anything that's just popping out and saying yes You you need to get this or you must have this like when we got the slam van the slam van had some amazing oh, liveries or some amazing wraps I was gonna call them wraps for the e sake of it being easy like the wraps looked absolutely amazing on the slam van they look so, so freaking good. Um, I'll be honest, I'm going to keep them exactly the same, I reckon. Um, let's keep the tires exactly the same, maybe. Like, I, I don't really want to change them that much. Windows, I'll have limo tint just for the sake of it. I mean, this is it, guys. This is, this is it. There doesn't really seem to be much that we can do to it. We can obviously pimp it out a little bit, but it keeps its 1950s shape. Maybe it's design like nothing really seems to change. I mean, I am a little bit sad about um, What it can look like I guess with the wraps. I mean none of these are really popping out I mean, what does it look like if we get fallen angel and we respray it say black possibly like oh Well damn son D -d -d Damn I will be honest, that does actually look quite freaking badass. Oh my god. That, my friend, looks quite spectacular. It really, really does. I mean, I don't really want to change the accent color, actually. Let's keep it yellow again. But holy moly, man. That actually looks freaking sweet as. I love this, man. I absolutely love the look of it down the side. Look at it. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Right, let's get this bad boy outside. Let's have a look at it. Like, holy. Damn. Hey, look. Jesus Christ, man. That looks so freaking nice. It really, really does. I mean, this is it, guys. This is the Classy Tornado. And I'm absolutely really happy that it, it actually keeps its 1950s look. Like, it doesn't change too much at all. And I think me keeping the air filter on the front as stock actually makes it look and it makes it feel a little bit more original. Like most of these cars, we change them so much that they, they do look good. But then after like a few moments, they, they look kind of oh, boring in my opinion. This, this has got a nice feel to it in my opinion anyway. I freaking love it. I love this pinstripe fire going down the side as well. It looks so freaking nice. Really, really does. But oh my god. There you go, guys. Anyway, the Declassy Tornado. Honestly, guys, I will see you later. Look after yourself. Take care. Have fun. And uh, don't do anything crazy. Bye-bye.